my god. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> that is crazy. How's it going, guys? Dre here, and welcome back to Bridge Constructor Portal. Now, today, we are getting on to the painful experiences in Bridge Constructor. Uh, last episode, we finished up the first 20 levels of the game, and uh, yeah, that's probably gonna get much, much worse now. So let's get into it and uh, see what happens here. Ooh. All right, so it looks like we just need to build three bridges across. Now, that's not gonna be easy, though, because we got no connection points for either of these bridges. So uh, yeah, we're just gonna have to go with this and see what happens. Now... For this one, I think I'm actually going to have to build up a platform for a bridge to go on it. You know what? I'll probably actually do a jump, because uh, a bridge is going to take a lot of weight. So if we do something like that with a jump at the end, I think that should work. So let's try something like that. Now, obviously, we still got to worry about the top bridge as well, and I'll probably connect this bridge to the bottom bridges as well. Uh... Don't think this is gonna do too much right now. You know what? I'll just actually connect this to this and that way these bridges are disconnected That way if any wobble happens not everything is affected. So let's try that And hopefully I did this right like we haven't went through all the way, but there we go At least there's enough room there land on it jump it. Ooh, okay Might have to fix that a little bit, but there we go and we got to fix the top one a little bit We got it though Okay, so we're just gonna make this a little bit further that way it gets a little bit more speed and let's make it a little bit more Smooth so that should be good this one all we really need to do is just drop this down like that Let's try the convoy. Let's see if this works now. Oh, this is a convoy of ten. I Hope this bridge can handle it. Oh god. They're hitting each other. Oh, there's a pile up. Okay. It's still somehow working Oh my god. <laughs> do you see it over there? No! Are you kidding me? The final freaking one? After all that chaos, I thought we totally had it, and just these guys right here had to screw it up for everybody. All right, made it even more smooth with a little bit more of a jump. Let's see, you know, I should probably smooth out the landing too, if this doesn't work, but they're obviously flying much better this time, and as long as that beam can handle it, which it did, we got it perfectly, so that wasn't too bad. We wastefully spent 36 grand, and we got 10 out of 10. Let's move on. Okay, a need for speed. So I'm thinking, wow. I don't know what I'm thinking just yet. Obviously, we're going to have to go down there. Uh, I guess we're going to have to do that right away. So let's connect to that. Now, I don't know. What is the bounce pad? Where does the bounce pad come into this? Now... Okay, so I have to jump out of this. Do I have to land on the bounce pad and then jump? I guess that would make sense. I don't remember what the blue lasers are. It's been a little while since I last played this. So I guess we're just gonna have to find out that. But uh, yeah, I think we're gonna have to land on that jump pad and jump all the way across to the end. Now, how many... Do we have 22? No, this is level 22. Okay, so we have eight convoy units that we gotta get across. All right, so just fill this up. It looks like we should be able to connect, yes, to everything down here. That's gonna actually be a pretty sturdy bridge, I think. All right, let's drive it. Just see what happens here. I think we're gonna need more speed, but, uh, oh, oh, actually, oh, oh, wait, 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 oh, maybe do we, do we have, oh, is that not a jump pad, is that a speed boost? So do we have to get it on enough speed to ramp all the way across? Because that would be so cool if that's the case. I think that's how I gotta do it. All right, well, this one's gonna be very, very difficult, because we gotta do this perfectly in terms of speed. And I don't really know a good way to slow them down. So first of all, I'm just putting a landing pad down here. Hopefully, if we land on that, we can get enough speed to go through again and do some serious air. So let's see where I land when we first go through, because that's the important part. Do we land on it? Okay, we did get a little bit too far, but... Oh my god, I hit the roof! <laughs> Okay, I'm actually going too fast, I think. Okay, so I just lifted up this end just a little bit, and I think that's probably all I need. I, I need to not go as high, and yes, there we go. That is the perfect trajectory to do this. Okay. I'm feeling good about today, guys. Our second one, and we really haven't had too many issues. Let's see if the convoy can withstand the weight of this thing, though. This is a really good bridge. I think we totally got it. As long as we don't crash into each other, 
Oh god, this is great. It's going right through just just like a zipper. They're cutting in between each other and look at that We got it. I mean you can't get much better than that. That was perfectly done Nothing hit each other. Nothing came close to breaking. Oh, can everyone go like this because that would be great There we go, and we only spent 28 grand that time. So not too bad. What do we got up next more goo? More speed pads. What's this one called? Helix. Helix? All right, this one's, uh... We've never really had one like this before, so we have no portals right now. You know what? Let's just hit drive, because I'm seeing this lever here, and I just want to see what goes on. So when we hit this, that pops up. That hits that lever. Oh, so it flips back and forth. We have to have half of them going up top and half of them going into the bottom. The thing being, we have to be up top first to disable this laser. So how do I get up top first? I'm pretty sure I know what we gotta do, but there's two buttons here. We obviously cannot hit this second button. I'm thinking we gotta do a crisscross in the middle here and actually jump the bottom up to the top and push the top down to the bottom. Let's just try that and uh, see what happens here. So we're gonna do... Uh, oh man, okay, this is actually gonna be really difficult because A, I'm gonna have a lot of speed, but also I need to make it kind of easy to fall down up here as well. So let's try that. Then we're just gonna do a little jump like that and have a landing pad over here. I guess we can just connect right to that. That makes sense. There we go, just like that. And that should work. I mean, unless my angles are way off. All right, let's test it out. See what happens here when indeed we do get enough speed. Is it enough? Not enough to get up. So that's a little unfortunate. And that happens when you don't make your way up. All right, so I did some fine tuning. I don't, oh, that was a really hard hit. We're getting closer as you can see, but no, we're still blowing up. So I think the best way that I found to improve a system in this is to just add double the points. So, if we make it a little bit more smooth to get up here and have four joints instead of two, well, I guess technically three joints, I think that should go quite well. It's just going to be a much smoother landing, and therefore, they should hopefully keep their momentum up a little bit. So, let's try that out. Ooh, okay, actually, let me... It's too, a little bit too wobbly. Can we reach that? Yes, we can. Okay, so that should stiffen it a little bit. There we go. Want to keep this thing nice and stiff, and... Yes! That's exactly how I wanted it. Okay, so the top needs some work, but we did it. Okay, and then it flips back and forth. Oh, God. That's going to be fun to deal with. So we have to have all this timed perfectly. All right, so I smoothed out the top a little bit. I also changed the bottom a little bit. Hopefully, oh, God, see, the, the finest minute movement really does screw it up quite a bit. So that is the tra trajectory it definitely needs. The top should actually still be good, so... I think this should be it here. I mean, that's gonna be close, actually. Ooh! Actually, we got a little bit too red for comfort there, but there we go. And it's flip-flop flopping back and forth. Okay, and now we obviously need to do the end. Now, this one, we should be able to just kind of fall off. And then, with this one, we should just be able to kind of just do a little bit of a, a jump at the end here. And that should connect both of them together. So, we'll connect these, though. Turn all of this into road, and... That looks good to me. I think that should work. And of course, we must reinforce. Oh, that, that was a good rhyme too. I, I'm, a, I'm a rhyme master today. All right, so that, I mean, that looks awesome. Let's hope it works here. This scares me how red it turns, but if it can handle it, it should be fine. We're going back and forth. At least that's done. Now let's see if the convoy works. Okay, that was a little more challenging. I like this. Oh, I'm really worried about the wobble. There we go. Up to the top. Just landed that one. We're getting really close to missing it, but you can see the back wheel just makes it up, flips it back and forth, and that's perfect. We can't get much better. I, I don't want to say too much yet because we know the last guy is always the worst one, but this time it indeed worked out. There we go. Oh, that was amazing. I like that one. It made me think. All right, level 24, faithful companion. The weighted Ooh. companion cube can also be used as a portable defense against turret okay, fire. Okay, good point. So we got a companion cube that drops behind us. So 
I'm gonna have to get, okay, I, I know immediately how to do this one. This one isn't gonna be that bad. So what we're gonna wanna do is do a little jump here because we're gonna have to drop down and we have to have a, an, a obviously a hole through so we can drop down. So we'll do something like that. We'll connect these together, but we'll turn these into road. Now we should be able to drop down. We gotta do like a landing thing down here. So let's just do something like that. That should be good. And then once again, as per usual, we must reinforce. Always reinforce. That's the most important part. Uh, we're just gonna go crazy with the triangles here. It's kind of weird playing a bridge constructor that isn't so focused on money. It's it's actually kind of nice that you can just go crazy in this game. And as long as you get people from point A to point B, you're doing a good job. All right, so that is uh, it's pretty crazy. But it just might work. So we're going to change all of this into road here. Obviously, we're gonna, we we're de are definitely going to have to fine-tune it a little bit. But you never know. Sometimes first try works. So going down. Oh, ooh, actually not bad. Not bad at all. And there's my companion cube, which I jump over. So yeah, like I said, fine-tuning. All right. So really, we don't have to do much at all. I'm just going to lower this down a little bit. Lower the jump down a little bit. I already lowered it, so I don't want to lower it too much, but we should be able to easily clear that. And that changed. Oh, man. Oh, man. Okay, I'm also worried about how uneven it is now, but let's try that again. Oh, my God, look how red it is. Oh, and that is not a light landing either. Okay, we might have to tune that just a little bit. And now we've made that jump way too much, so we'll just raise that a bit. Try again. Again, it's all about the fine-tuning, guys. There we go. Actually, it's really not that bad. I think it should be able to support itself. That should be enough of a jump to not jump over it. And see you later, Sentry. <laughs> okay, the big question is, how quickly do these things come out? Because, oh, the wobble is real. But, oh, don't break, don't break. We got it. We're totally good. Oh, that was great. And, whoa, what was... Excuse me? Where, where did that blow up? Must have blew up as it was going throughout the tube, but well done. 24 is done. Let's move on to 25. I'm liking, I'm liking these levels. Two-way traffic. Uh-oh. Uh, ooh, okay. So we got to go through the portal, then it resets us around, and then we got to... Well, how the heck am I going to do this? Let's think about this for a second. How am I going to... I think what I'm gonna have to do is just really utilize my space here. Obviously, there's a little bit of a jump there. I could technically do another crisscross strategy, but I think I can also possibly set this up to the point where if we come out of this one, we might have just two lanes going all the way through. So we'll try something like that. Let's uh, lower this quite, ooh, ooh, okay. If we can do something like that, is that, yeah, that should be jumpable. This is all road, by the way. This is the first road. So what I'm thinking is we drive, well, no, because, well, I guess I could go either way because it's, it's a portal. So if you go through this one, you're coming out that one. If you go through that one, you're coming out this one. So, oh man, my brain, my brain is just not ready for this one. <laughs> Okay, so what if we try... Oh, we're gonna do a huge jump, though. Okay, well, I'm just gonna let it happen. This is what I have so far. I, I, This is probably the one I'm most confused about. And it's weird, because it looks pretty straightforward. But my brain just can't... Can't strategize this one. Okay, but we're just doing cross beams all the way down. And, uh... Yeah, basically just having a double-decker bridge here. Uh, that's kind of what we're doing. Now we can connect uh, tie points to that as well, which we definitely will do. Uh, yeah, what I'm going to do over here is just go above the road and connect to those final two points. But this is going to be very top-heavy. There's no connection point over there, so we definitely want to reinforce this with many, many cords. But I will also put some cords to connect these together. We might be over-engineering this, but hey, that's the fun part. Let's drive it. And, oh, yes, that's what I was worried about. Uh, all right, so everything is screwing up at this point. All right, so we need to get a little bit more crazy with our support structure up here, and uh, that might be good. Let's, let's try that. Ooh, God. Okay, I am going to have to lift that a little bit just by the sag of it. Oh, look at this poor little support beam over here. Okay, so we didn't make the jump. We jumped over the damn button, too, but would this work if we do some small fine-tuning? Let's find out. Yep, it probably will. 
Okay, so we're gonna help that beam out by connecting this beam together, and you know what? Let's do another crisscross through here like that. That should strengthen that joint quite a bit. There we go. All right, so we could definitely fix the starting a little bit, but hey, if it works, it works. As long as we land on that button, thank God, and there we go. It's a little bit bumpy. Just gonna make the ending, and perfect. Look at that. Convoy time! This is when it gets scary because we have 10 we need to deal with here on an already flimsy bridge that's getting hit quite a bit, as you can see. Oh, God. Okay, now we gotta land and somehow this not break. Mind you, we're getting so much air. Ooh, we just lost some people. That's okay. Oh, we crashed each other over here, too. Oh, this one's brutal. All right, so let's spread these guys out a bit. Let's get them to stop hitting their head. I'm also gonna jump it. Uh, well, that's a little bit too much. That should be good there. And let's see. Oh, no, convoy. I just wanna see if they maybe miss their head now. Oh, that is close, but that's exactly what I wanted. Ooh, we're knocking off people. That doesn't matter, though, as long as we get the cars back. Now, the crisscross is going to be the hard part. And, oh, my God. Oh, <laughs> that is crazy. Oh, I love it, though. It worked. Look at that. There's so many red zones here. This is not optimal, but damn it, it did it. It got the whole convoy across. And there goes the final one. Oh, that was fan-freaking-tastic. Spent a small fortune on that one. But in this episode, I just want to say we've done all convoys. We've done every single one of them perfectly, and that feels great. All right, I'm going to call it a day here, guys. That was a good few levels there of Bridge Constructor Portal. I hope you guys enjoyed this as always. Thanks for watching and liking, and I'll see you in the next one. Oh, 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 oh